Hey everyone, Technomancer here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to disable forced auto update on your Samsung phone. I'm going to show you for how to turn it off or disable for apps and then the actual system or the OS. So for apps, you're going to go to the Play Store. And once you're in your Play Store, just simply tap on your profile. And from profile here, we're going to go to settings. Now in the settings here, we're going to go to network preferences and auto update apps. So we're going to tap on that. And instead of having any of these options, we're going to say don't auto update apps. So go back. And this will prevent any apps from being auto updated. Now, if you're looking to disable it for the actual system or your Android version, so what you're going to do is go into your setting and then go all the way down to software update. And then in the software update, you're going to see system update preferences and then smart update we're going to go ahead and disable these two options so you're going to go back here make sure these are up so we're going to turn off this one and then this one both of these are going to be turned off now with these turned off we're not going to get auto updates and then the next thing you need to do important is that you're going to click on the about phone and then go to software information and right here where it says bill number you're going to press it or tap on it about seven times until you get into developer mode so I'll tap on here it says one more and then you enter your phone pin and then hit OK and then go back and then back one more time and this time you're gonna see a new option comes up that says developer options so you're gonna tap that now right here we're gonna go ahead and search for auto update system if this is turned on you're gonna to want to turn that off and once that's turned off, you can turn off developer mode. And now we have disabled any forced update on our Samsung phone. So that's how you do it. I hope this video was helpful. So please consider hitting that like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks. We'll see you guys next time.